Once it is 8 p.m. and the last voter has cast her ballot, you may begin to close the ballot counter. To close the ballot counter, you will need the ballot counter, the voting equipment keys, the pink ender card, the step-by-step -step closing instructions, and the AccuVote certification form. To properly close the ballot counter, follow the step-by-step -step closing instructions in the red closing folder. If there are ballots in the emergency voting slot, these ballots will need to be run before the ballot counter is closed. Once all ballots have been cast, you may begin to close the ballot counter. First, lower the security plate. Unlock and remove the printer cover, and while pressing yes and no, run the ender card through the unit. A summary statement will begin printing automatically. This statement should be attached to the zero tape that was printed in the morning. Once the summary statement has completed printing, the LCD screen will ask you if you'd like another copy. Press yes. You will need to print two additional summary statements. Once the tape have completed printing, have all the judges sign the bottoms of the tapes. The first printed statement, the one with the zero tape attached, needs to be sealed into the envelope for Ramsey County. The two additional statements each need to be sealed in the two remaining summary statement envelopes. At this point, you can turn the ballot counter off and place it in its carrying case. Put the keys and power cord back into the front pouch of the carrying case. The head judge is responsible for delivering the closed ballot counter to the Ramsey County Elections Office on election night, where the results will be transmitted to the state's reporting system. If you have any questions or encounter problems when closing the ballot counter, call the Ramsey County Elections Hotline for help.